Okay, so we have the Hunter SRMs that I do want. They're in the science base, and the civilians, they have high strength, but it's such a low level system, I'm probably just going to go for it anyway. No, 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 it's a science station. I didn't even check how much data they've got. And they, they like us. They like us already. I mean, they've, in fact, actually, let's have a look. Yeah, they've got 400 trade data with a maximum of 1,500. There's no way I'm destroying them. I'm going to go into the station. That's it. You, you two deal with the zombie threat. While I dock here and, uh, and do the old purchasing thing. Let's make you happy. We have Hunter SRM. Um, I'm gonna ha I'm gonna get it just because then it's an option. Here we go. Got some more data. Wow. Oh bloody zombies! Stop it! They're not that easy to hit with this. <laughs> I can't believe I was tractor beaming something and just vaporized it accidentally. Oh, okay. There's there's a bit of a a field of of goodies. Just over here. Well, that didn't last long. <laughs> Neither would that. Oi. Um Anything useful there? No, nothing for me. I've got one more Hunter SRM blueprint. Science base has it. Doesn't like me enough. They have plenty of trade data. Yeah, why not? If I just give them some goons... That'll make them happier. Get the Hunter SRM, that unlocks that technology. God, actually, I've got to be careful because that's quite close. Why are you shooting me? Oh, I'm covered in zombies. Well, you can shoot the zombies off me if you want. Oh, let me guess. The UTA have decided to have a go. Fine. You bloody don't. I'm having no bloody cloaked vessels dropping crap. S cycle round. Here we go, right. There. Hunter SRM. Job done. Goons the data. And I've gone up a level. My favourite. <laughs> Got ten points to spend. I'm g again. I'm gonna save them up. I think. I know I said that before, and then spent them all on armour. But I'm gonna. Wow, I just laid an egg and it immediately hatched. It's a little harsh. Right. Let's go to this system. There's nothing useful there apart from the next stage of the mission. Because I don't think there is anything I can... I mean, I can get a bit more on engines or, or turrets. 
And I do want the battle station just because it looks awesome. I could respect launchers. No, I'm not going to respect launchers. The only reason why not is because I might well be able to just get things. Oh god. Now we're um fighting already against the UTA. Not very agile now, are you? You right hook. Oh god, no you are a little bit. Ooh, look at that, big brother. You're just on the edge of the main beam. Didn't really matter, of course. Jeez. I am still so impressed with the just sheer firepower of this. Just cut through them. They might as well not be there. <laughs> oh, I've lost a ship. Yeah, you managed to stand up to that quite well, actually. I'll give you credit where credit's due. such a wide turning circle. I'm tempted to strip off even more armour. I really liked it when it was agile, you know, originally. Because it's not... I've not gotten close with it being destroyed yet. Um, and I'm annoyed most of all by its slow turning circle. So... I figure that it will probably be more useful to me, more agile, because it doesn't need to be as tough as it is. That sounds a bit strange, but it doesn't. So yeah, let's redo it, and I'm going to, oddly enough, strip the armour off. I know, I know, it might be just complete madness. But I'm going to give it a go. Just a little bit more manoeuvrable now. So, the system. Oh my god, what on earth? The final crossing? Oh, this is this is it. We're getting into the core. Because look, that's a blockade. Star map. We're getting into the core now. This is actually it. Oh, there's the fortress shield. Stuff that. I'm going to head to that system there. Crack open the fortress shield. You know, unlock the fortress shield as a, uh, as a as a piece of equipment. Yeah, right. Before I go into, the, yeah, I've got to get the fortress shield, especially if I'm stripping all my armor off. Fortress shield's the way to go. It's got to be. Just let that absorb all the ores. System map. Let's crack this blockade open. I'm quite excited, actually. I mean, I don't know the exact specifics of the fortress shield, but who... Oh, oh god, there we go, there we go. That's the thing that needs to die. And it's gonna. It's certainly giving my shields a bit of a run for their money, but... As per usual... It doesn't really stand up much. And this is to unlock the bloody um, fortress shield, and already my shields are standing up to it quite well. Alright, come on. We've got one more enemy. Oh, 
who's ran away quite far away. Come on. Die, you stupid zombies. Oh, he's gotten too far away. I can't be doing with it. <laughs> oh, go away, you silly little thing. Oh, excuse me. That was very rude. Right. Next stop. No, not you. Well, no, next stop's actually this system. It's the colony base. Whew. And the civilians are neutral but strong, so I need to make friends. Whoa, hang on a second. We have your mothership jump drive disrupted. <laughs> We can do this the easy way or the hard way. You're not going anywhere until you pay us. Stuff that. Go away, you stupid bounty hunters. Okay, here we go. Whatever you are, you're gonna die. I'm slowed down. Okay. Well, oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Oh my God, there's so many blueprints. They're bloody everywhere. Oh, hello. You look expensive. Not for long. Yeah, good choice. Little shit. Good choice. Good target choice. Hello, brute. That's it. Get into the main beam. That's the ticket. Okay, shield holding well. Got an improved brute. It's. I right, gave my shield to run for their money, that's for certain. Oi, you. Don't you get away from us. Well, the bounty hunters are persistent. I wouldn't say that they're especially powerful, but they are persistent. They really should have done their research on me. Honestly, they really should. Oh, there we go, that's you. Oh, you're a speedy little fellow, aren't you? Yeah, that, look, there he goes, very fast. Oh, jeez. That was very profitable. most profitable. There's another ship that ran away. It'll be back. Okay, we've got that blueprint there, but nothing else. Certainly nothing over this way, anyway. Oh, the blueprint popped. All got absorbed. I don't know why, but I didn't think blueprints could pop. Oh, that was good luck. No cloned goons because we're full of goons. <sighs> right, let's just wait for this improved Hydra to return, shall we? I'm not going after it. God, it's coming in quick. I've got my beams warmed up for you. Will you be my friend? Um, is that a yes or a no? Okay, apparently we've earned a lot of respect. What do you mean we have work to do we can't hang around the mothership all day? What's your problem? We've just, did you not just see all this fighting that we've been doing? Killing blooming bounty hunters? Collecting technology? Do you not see any... Obviously not. Right, I didn't spot any new designs, but we did get one. The Hydra. Okay, right. 
Let's have a look if the Hydra is any good. Um, it's less manoeuvrable, but it's got more cargo. It's got... Holy crap! So, three shooters and a turret. This thing, slightly, it's, it's less manoeuvrable. A bit more cargo capacity. Apart from that, it's the same as far as the general stats go. But look at it. I mean, it's... It costs a bit more, but who cares? Holy crap. Yeah, <laughs> this is like a no-brainer. Okay, there we go. Fill it full of those. We have Hunter SRMs. That will be useful, you see. I knew there was a reason why I, uh, I went for them. Let's leave the two small tractor beams in. There, it can be like a kind of an anti-zombie thing. So the SRMs for the zombies. It's got the the point defense for the zombies. The SRMs probably are fine on their own, to be fair. Um, so I could just boost its shields and beams. Let's leave it with that setup for now. Wow. I'm gonna pump the forward armor a little bit. Give it a bit more in the way of crew. Sorted. We need to unlock some of these ones, because I'm pretty sure these are tiny hulls, are just not going to be worth it when compared to that hull. I think the Colt's doing alright, but it would be nice to have something... See, although it's got five small shooter mounts, it would be nice to have something with utility mounts. What did I have before? I know, I know, I know, I'm kind of going back to the turtle head, but you know what? Oh, the God, it's just the sheer firepower of those mounts. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep those mounts going. Right. But yeah, we've unlocked some bounty hunter tech. Ha <laughs> ha! Beauty. But yes, staying manoeuvrable is very, very useful. So... Star map. Now let's go here. You're gonna let us go this time, bounty hunters? Have we shown you the shown you our metal? There it is. They're kind of a bit they're neutral, but you know what? We have the goon bribes. Here you go, have some slaves. Will you be our friends? <laughs> some ex individuals for you to experiment on. Nice one. Oh, no, didn't quite. Come on. There we go. Yeah, have some goons. Okay, have some more goons. Give us the fortress shield. Now, uh, how much res have we got? 4,000. No, I'm not going to buy any goons. Job done. We now have the fortress shield. Let's head to this star system. We haven't got like a super duper engine. Yeah, we haven't got that, the inertial engine. Oh, I see. We need the we we actually don't understand how to use it. We we, we know how to build one, but how to plug it into a ship, we haven't got a clue. It would make sense then to spend some research on engines, because engines are a key component. And I'm getting the impression... What is it? So although it's not as fast, and it is hungry for power, it's got more manoeuvrability, and it's better acceleration, I'm guessing the thrust power is. Better acceleration for big chunky ships like mine. Okay. Yeah, that, that's what the simple bloody means. I need level 8 in engines. Right. Refit costs 300, that's costing a fortune. Um Yes. I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a go for a while. I'm going to uh, use the best shield technology money can buy to protect my vessels.
Now, I'm still not going to spend the points because look, once the mothership's upgraded, we're going to gain a bit more rank. So let's head to this blockade. It's level 80 blockade, ouch. 